Hello my friends and welcome to Bevolex. Today we will actually make the repair of a door that goes to a small drawer that my wife brought me from her day nursery. As you can see one of the hinges actually was uh, torn out and I had to make a repair. The easiest way was to cut off the destroyed area, make a new inset and attach the hinge again. But just follow me now on the video. As I didn't have plywood in the correct thickness, I simply had to laminate together a few pieces. Sanding the inset to the correct size and here you see my small scale uh, belt sander. This uh, belt sander actually is the reason why you most of the time when I work with machines you see me wearing this uh, full protection face mask. Because some years ago this small sander actually planted some dust particles in my eye that didn't just wash out with the tears and uh, I didn't have much more a choice than about well, three days later go to the eye doctor and he had to remove these small particles. So, well, learning from uh, small accidents, incidents and since then I usually wear my face protector.
Well, three door wheels, two pocket screws and two component glue should actually hold the inset in place in a strong uh, manner so that it can withstand the forces that may be applied by attaching the joint or the, the hinge again. Filling the holes of the pocket screw with a combination of two component glue mixed with sawdust and then sanding it smooth. Since the color of the inset was quite different from the rest of the door and I didn't have any veneer or anything, I did cheat a little bit and simply glue some self-adhesive foil around this uh, fix so that it looked at least halfway like the veneer but you'll see the foil was a little bit brighter than the rest of the wood but oh well it looks halfway decent and in the end it's uh, just a piece a utility piece and not a show piece. Well, meanwhile the door is attached again to the furniture and I could happily recognize or realize that the other part of the hinge did fit nicely to the, well, to the cabinet where I had to take the door off. So it worked quite well, nice and well. Well, hi folks. Well, this concludes the repair of a drawer, actually of the door, of a, a drawer that is used in a childcare, in a nursery. It was uh, broken and brought to me. What actually did, well, put me off a little bit, these special furnitures for uh, childcare uh, organizations, institutes, they tend to be rather expensive. And when I just had a, a short look at the thing, uh, didn't go too much into the depth. Uh, yeah, well, you would think that this is uh, high quality plywood. But, well, what is in reality? It's just veneered particle board actually with an edge banding that looks like plywood. It's a little bit cheap, 
But uh, for all the company things, yeah, well, as long as it doesn't break, nobody will guess it, so I can ask a price that's uh, for this thing. Yeah, well, I did fix it. I did cut out the particle board and actually put in real plywood and I could attach the fastener again and uh, yeah well I hope it will hold now for some time I couldn't find veneer or paint or stain in the same uh, color that the door has but after all it's a piece to be used it's not a show piece and so I just did hide it a little bit with uh, self adhesive, adhesive uh, foil and oh well we'll see well, if you liked the video, well, I would appreciate if you would give me a thumbs up. And please, if uh, you didn't subscribe to my channel yet, maybe you can consider to uh, subscribe to my channel and get more videos where I fix and repair and build new things. Well, thanks for having watched this video. And until the next time, see you. Bernie, tschüss.